I was 13, I think, when I got my first tattoo. And I did it myself with my dad's pocket knife. It was three letters, FTW. means fuck the world. I'm not me anymore. I'm this weird concoction created named Brandon Bond, this entity, this strange, bizarre. You know, it's like a plumber. I'm not gonna have a plumber come over and I'm not gonna tell the plumber how to do his job. I think a client should select an artist that, that they trust and respect and that's awesome and then let them go crazy, you know? To tell a tattooer how to tattoo it's like telling a hooker to suck it, how to suck it. Like whenever I make conventions, everybody wants like pictures, you know, like this and stuff. That's cool, like I, it doesn't bother me because that's where I came from. You know, that, that crazy mentality is, is who I was for a long time. And, and, and now I, I feel that I've just outgrown it. You know, because the tattoos will mean whatever the fuck you want them to mean in the end. You know, all my tattoos represent something to me. Even though it's all gibberish to the eye, like to me, it reminds me of where I was at, what I was doing, who did it, what my life was like, who I was fucking at that time in my life. Like everything about who I am at that moment in time is frozen and encapsulated in that tattoo. So I don't have to put my fucking granddad's initials in there, you know? I know that that's the tattoo I got when my granddad died. I hate it. If I could just have them stick their fucking arm through a glory hole, and tattoo them, you know, I would totally do it. Now that my whole body's tattooed, it's more like, God damn it, just fill that shit up and let me go home, you know? I hate to say that, because clients always ask, you know, does it hurt? And of course we're like, fuck no, you know? It doesn't hurt okay. But it does, it hurts, it hurts bad. It's cool. Do people believe you when you say that? I don't know. They pay me. I guess they do, I don't know. So what would For be about two seconds till I hit them with the needles. I want to know what it's like just to be Brandon again and not have to get up and, and answer 2,000 emails. I think that would be awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm constantly in airports, you know, constantly in hotels, constantly in front of cameras, constantly doing all this crap that really I don't want to do. I'm just doing it for money, let's be honest. I'm a shitbag, degenerate, gun carrying, capitalist motherfucker, but. At the end of the day, I have to believe that I've, if I put love into my life and if I throw positive energy into the world, that I'm going to get some of that back. Otherwise, what the fuck are we doing here anyway? You know?